Welcome back to another skate park review. This time we're in Enumclaw, where nothing weird has ever happened. Before you skate, you're going to want to saddle up and hit the local. They can sell you up to five shots of espresso at a time if you want. But I just went with the bacon, egg, and cheese. This park crams a lot into a tight space. It's got a lot of cool features. You got your red curb. You got your jersey barrier. You got this mountain thing. Thankfully, it was just us because if you had a lot of people here, it would be a zoo. As always, here's what we like about this park. We always like the free air. We also like the red curb spine they got going on here. It's pretty unique. And the fact this wall has a uh, vert up there. We also like hitting the tight end with a buddy. A lot of cool lines in here. Definitely like these little hips everywhere. Hip on the Jersey Barrier. Here you'll see Roy getting bucked off his horse. He came back and made it. This rainbow feature is pretty unique. It's a little intimidating, but if you pick yourself up from your bootstraps, commit, you can make it. I'd say the one thing we're not like a huge fan of is this uh, mountain feature. It's um, good on paper, but I don't really know what to do. So with that, we're gonna give this park an 89 horsepower rating. After skating, I uh, was ready to get my Mr. Hands on a beer, so we went to the Mint restaurant and Ale House. I got some tacos, but a uh, great place to hydrate after a good long skate session. Shout out to SD and Roy for making the journey out with me. Uh, it's a good time. Go check it out. And definitely don't Google any news stories about this place from 2005. Cheers.